To find our dharma, our purpose, what are we looking at? Well, I'll tell you. Okay, number one, you can first look at your natural skills, talents. How do people have natural skills and talents? How does that work? It is not religion. This is science. Energy cannot be created nor destroyed. It can only be transferred. Okay, look to the person next to you.、Uh, they were never created, never destroyed. Look at the other side. They were never created, never destroyed. What does that mean? <clears throat> they can never be created, never destroyed. Now you're saying, yeah, but they can be destroyed. The body will deteriorate and all the rest. Actually, even the body, when it deteriorates, it recycles back into Earth. You know that. That's physical, and then you have metaphysical. Needs to also be transferred. Energy carries memory. Memory is transferred. Some people are naturally skilled, naturally talented. What does this mean? It means、uh, in, in in our practices we call karma. It means it's carried on. The memory is carried on. When we look at our natural skills and talents, we need to understand why it's being carried on. Because maybe it's being carried on to be used and fulfill a purpose. <clears throat> right. So number one, you can make a list. Of your natural skills and talents. Okay, I'm going to ask you guys to do this in a moment. Number two, make a list of your passions and desires. What is a desire? What is a passion? It's an e. It's an energy in. It is not from you. It's from beyond you, felt and moves through you. Your channel. So it is a receive. It's a download. It's a message. It's a pull. It's like universe saying, "Hey, come this way." And the only way universe speaks to you or through you is through emotion, because it's not going to use English. Hey, I am universe. Can you hear me? What does this mean? It means. When we are feeling that passion, feeling that desire, so now you have something that has been brought on and carried on through your energy path. Now you've also got something that the energies, the collective energies, are pulling you towards. Do you get what I'm saying? These now will all add up to your dharma, to finding your dharma. Okay. Number three, the skills and knowledge. Okay, or expertise, we can even call it. You have acquired this life. I, I was I was working at a noodle bar before. Do you get what I'm saying? Why was I working at a noodle bar before? Why? Oh, I learned management there. I learned leadership there. Noodle franchise. I learned leadership. Does leadership come in handy with me fulfilling my dharma now? Yes or no? Very, very, very handy. Okay, I was like, well, "Why was I selling franchises for so long?" Right? Because I had to learn sales. It's something that I, I don't think I was naturally good at sales because I was really shy and everything. No, but because I had to sell the franchise because that was my job before. Right? I had to learn sales. Now, does selling motivation require the same type of communication? Yes or no? It's the same thing. Why has everything? Move the way it's moved. Place you into these positions to learn whatever skills. How now? All this combines to one. Are you guys understand what I'm saying? Okay. And number four, the final thing. <clears throat> what serves the world? If I look at this, look at this, and look at this. What in the world can I serve? What can I help in the world? Who can I help in the world? What can I do for the world? What can I do for other people? Using the mix of these things, what type of occupations are available? What type of charities are available? What type of leadership is available? What type of missions or visions are available? That will give us a good indication to where it is right now. I'm going to do a plus one here. Why is this a plus one? Okay. What can Be learned again. Skills, knowledge, 
Remember we said before, we said learn it, live it. Learn it, live it. Learn it, live it, give it. Okay, so now you've got this, but all through life, all through life, we're students of life. We're students all our lives. Are there other things that can be learned? New skills, new, 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 new knowledge that can be learned, that can fulfill. Maybe because when you do this, you'll say, I know what can serve the world based on this, but I'm missing some skills and talents or knowledge. No problem. Can they be learned? If they can't, okay, cool. Maybe if I learn this, then I can fulfill exactly what I want to fulfill. For how many of you this is making sense? Give me a aha. Everyone take an inhale, please. And so exhale. 